Hey everyone, this is Galen Martling. Today I am sharing simple heat embossing and I'm using gold embossing powder to create this beautiful gold on black or gold on dark cardstock. And I'm going to use Unity Stamps. I have the very best gal for the sentiments and inked florals background stamp uh, for the gorgeous large floral. And so I am starting with a piece of black smooth cardstock and I'm adding a powder tool to um, create an anti-static anti kind of effect so that some of the embossing powder doesn't stick onto the cardstock. However, it will stick a little bit. Um, so you'll see how I use a brush to help with that. And so I use the Misty stamping tool along with a sticky mat and place that uh, stamp where I want it to be on the cardstock and ink it up with watermark ink. In this case, I have Versamark ink. Um, any watermark ink that you might have works fine. And then you just rub that on. I did two passes with it. I'm showing one pass now. And you could see um, it shows up glossy with that um, watermark ink and it sticks to that embossing powder. And so you just sprinkle the embossing powder over wherever your stamping is. This is a huge stamp, but you know, you can use a smaller stamp just the same. Um, you use a paint brush or something that is more narrow to wipe away most of this, the leftover um, embossing powder that you don't want to be um, heat embossed. So, um, you know, that's a trial and error um, to see what works best with your heat tool and your paper. And so now when you heat it, you can see it melts right in there and it becomes a beautiful metallic gold color. It's so pretty. So simple too. You don't need any other coloring for this. No coloring involved. No markers, painting, or anything. And so I chose to die cut a portion of this to fit onto my card base. And um, so I used some rectangles and scallops, uh, scallops and rectangles nesting dies by Unity. And you place that right on the um, another layer of uh, a frame layer, if you will, and that is in gold. Also, I have gold shine paper that I used, and then I use a flat um, ATG tape applicator and I also use a, a bit of foam tape for the sentiments and now I just chose to have a little bit of ribbon accent I had this shimmery gold ribbon and I wanted to use that I thought it would be a good accent very simple to just add um, right over that background and then I tape it flat onto the card base everything and then I'm going to pop up the sentiments with a little bit of foam tape to finish. It's so pretty and easy to do. I hope you give it a try. Thanks so much for watching. Please take a moment to like and share if you will and have a wonderful day.